In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how you create a wipe transitions within seconds and later in this video, I will show you how you get a wipe transitions using Filmora. So let's get into it. So here we are right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. I already have two different clip right here. So all I have to do is just drag my first clip at the second video track and move my second clip under my first clip like that. So it's actually on you how much seconds transitions you actually need. In my case, five or 10 frame transitions is really good. So for that, I just move my playhead at the end of my first clip, hold shift and left arrow key. Here is a five frame. So all I have to do is just drag my second clip like that so the next thing I need to do is just go to effects and search transform and here we have transform under distort just drag this on both of your footage so I'm going to work on my first clip so for now I just hide my second clip select your first clip go to effects control and here we have transform so all I have to do is to add a positioning keyframe right that and now I just hold shift right arrow key here is the five keyframes and now i need to move my horizontal value because i want my footage to move to the very left side just like that once you're done with it just select your both keyframes and move it at the end of your clip like that and here we have a simple slide right here so if you want to add a blur so all you have to do is just uncheck your use composition and add a shutter angle between 0 to 360 in my case 180 is really good for me and our first footage movement is just ready now we need to work on a second footage so for now I just hide my first clip and go with the second clip now same as we done in a first clip just create a positioning keyframe but this time we just move our first key frame to the very right side just like that until your footage it just disappear once you're done with it just hold shift right arrow key and click on this reset parameter your footage is just coming out from right to left like that now we need to add a blur so for that i just uncheck this use composition and add a shutter angle as 180 we done in first footage and there we go our second footage movement is just ready so select your keyframes and move it at the very beginning and just uncheck your first footage and there you go yeah it's working really good you can also increase or decrease the duration of your transitions by increasing or decreasing the duration of your first or second clip as we done before so it is a simple way how you can add a wipe transitions before proceeding further with this video i just want to take a minute and tell you guys about epidemic sound if you're looking for some high quality music and sound effects for your youtube videos or for your client project epidemic sound is a great option for you they have huge library that you can explore and find best music for you recently epidemic sound introduced most powerful search engine now you can navigate thousands of tracks and sound effects in seconds now you can search using descriptive words or sentence to get a perfect results let's suppose I need music for my cinematic sequence so I just search cinematic sequence and there we go here we have many cinematic music that we can use right away using this feature we can save a ton of time so i really recommend you guys go ahead and check it out epidemic sound link in the description below you can use my code to get a 50 percent off and a 30 days free trial so i hope you will get the best music for your videos So here we are right inside of Filmora, go to transitions and here I have a lot of transitions. Simply I just go to the search bar and search blur roll. And there we go, we have a blurry roll right here with a different directions. You can apply any one that you like. So I'm just go with this simple one, apply between our clip and there we go. Yeah, it's working really good, but it's a little bit longer. So for that, I just hold it at the end and make it smaller. Or you can say I just decrease the duration and there we go. Yeah, now it's working really good. You can also double click on your transition and here we have some duration. We have some basic settings. You can apply anything that you like. 
Yeah, that's looking really good. You can also try out some other transitions with a different direction. So we are just applying a right to left direction. Now let's try out this up to down direction, which is actually a wipe transition with a different direction. Change the duration to 10 frames. And there we go. Yeah, it's working really good. You can also try out other transitions. There are many transitions in Filmora. I mentioned the Filmora link in the description below. You can try out Filmora for free. So yeah, that's all for today's video. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, give me a big thumbs up and comment down below. If you have any question, please let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. I will see you in the next one.